the Clear Checkbook Money Management Palm WebOS app demonstration. The first thing we're going to do is load the application. Now you enter your username and password. If you don't actually have a username and password, you can create an account by clicking on the Create an Account button below. The main page shows your overall balances and the balances for each account. If you click on the account, you can see the transactions. To add, an account, or to add a transaction, just click on the plus icon and enter your details. We're just going to enter a test transaction for $15 worth of gas. So enter $15 for the amount, put in our description, which we're just going to say is gas. You can select whether it's a withdraw, deposit, transfer, etc. And then you select your account that it's coming from. In this case, we'll say it came from our checking account. And we want to set the category as gas so we can track this in our reports. Now that transaction's added. Now we're going to go back to the overviews, and you can see that our balances have changed. The spending limits are a great way to set budgets. We're going to create a budget of $100 for our gas. So $100 a month we're going to allocate for gas. So we go down and select gas. And we can select what day to have it reset on. Now you can see that our $15 transaction, so we have $85 remaining in that limit. These are reminders, so you can actually add recurring transactions and reminders in the system. This is just a, a view of one that we've already added. So we've got an $86 phone bill that gets posted on the 29th of every month. And we have some basic reports. So we've got some pie charts on our category spending. And we have some line graphs based on our overall saving and spending habits. Now we're going to see how we can edit our categories and accounts. So this is the accounts page. You can add new accounts. You can edit existing ones. And the categories page is very similar. You can add and edit and delete your categories here. And deleting is as easy as just swiping it away. And on this page, you can set whether you want the account overviews to be your main page or one of your other accounts when you log in. And that's the app.